Pisces. So when I was shuffling, I got that one, I feel like somebody, okay, somebody is like deciding if they want to cut something out. And like, also somebody's looking at like their investments, like someone you could have invested in or like something you could have invested in, you're taking a look at that right now. And you're contemplating if it was a good idea or if it's a good idea to continue investing. Also, um, I feel like you have a connection with two people. Fire sign, yeah, seven of pentacles. You're looking at what you're investing in. But I feel like you have a connection with two people. Fire sign, earth sign. Okay. Oh, wow. The tower. Yeah, I think you're going to choose to maybe walk away from something. Three of wands. Yeah, you could, there could be a lack of progress here. You want to start making like faster progress and you're going to do something that's going to cause a tower moment or a tower moment that's going to happen between you and somebody else. I feel like you have, like I said, I feel like there's a connection with two people and you're looking at who to cut out. Like, I really feel like you, because I got the King of Swords a couple times and I think it's you. So, oh yeah. Judgment, Two of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. You want a new beginning with somebody or somebody wants a new beginning with you, but you could currently be in a relationship or have a connection with somebody already. Okay, this might get more for Pisces. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, signs. Ten of Cups, yeah, someone here makes you really happy. Oh, shit. Oh, hello. <laughs> All right, so you could be choosing between your current partner and an ex. Somebody might want to come forward, especially with this Page of Cups here. You have the Six of Cups and the Page of Cups. So yeah, somebody might be messaging you. Could be an ex or an old friend or something like that. And you guys, still the connection's still there. Four of Pentacles. So yeah, you could be letting go of something, actually. Yeah, I have the High Priestess here. So maybe you were holding on to this for a long time, but I think you're letting go of something. Maybe you were holding a grudge against somebody and you're letting that go. If you guys didn't break up on the best terms, it was pretty unclear on how you guys is how you guys were feeling when you broke up. But you're trying to clear that up. But this person that you're with currently could be an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You have to like do something about it because I feel like you have a connection with two people. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles. You're gonna let um, you're gonna let some go. You have the Five of Pentacles here, clarifying the Seven of Pentacles. So you're definitely gonna let some go. It's gonna cause a tower moment. It's gonna shock somebody. You must clarify the tower for Pisces. Clarify the tower for Pisces. Yeah, somebody's gonna you know, be confused as to, oh wow, yeah. It's gonna be the Earth sign, King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could be starting something new with the Earth sign or you could be tearing down a foundation with an Earth sign, like that you've built with an Earth sign. So you could be quitting a job. It was clear by the three of wands. Yeah, you might want to see progress with the Leo, or you just might want to go towards something that makes you more happy. Sun card. So yeah, maybe this isn't your wish fulfillment. Maybe this isn't completely how you thought it would go with this earth sign, or maybe they don't make you as happy as your ex did, or something like that. But yeah, you're moving towards happiness here. It was clear by the Ace of Pentacles. Why is there some pentacles here for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus side? And this reading is going so fast. So I feel like you guys are ready to um, do this. <laughs> so yeah, you have the Hermit in reverse um, at the bottom of the deck. So one, there could be a Virgo that you're not being 100% truthful with, or they're not being 100% truthful with you. Or this is you clarifying the Ace of Pentacles. You could want a new job, a new beginning, a new start, new happiness, new something. And you could be leaving a Virgo behind or a Virgo's leaving you behind. Or this could just be you not keeping shit to yourself anymore. Because the moon card and the, and the hermit are like very, they don't talk. They don't tell people shit. They just kind of keep it to themselves. But with the moon here, something is being revealed. A new beginning is being revealed to you. So maybe somebody does come forward. It could be, definitely could be an ex or a friend. Something. Okay. Could be done with a Scorpio. Here we just clarify judgment. Yeah, I feel like this is you 
trying to decide what to do. Judgment's definitely a decision. Why is judgment here for Pisces? Why is the judgment card here for Pisces? Page of Cups. Ooh, temperance in reverse. Okay, so. Yeah, this could be a quick decision because usually this is like about patience. This is this is a quick energy here in the reverse for me. So, yeah, something is unbalanced with the judgment card here. It's you're going to bring balance to the situation. You have the page of cups twice. So definitely this offer coming in is going to cause a tower moment for you. I feel like it's for you and this person you're with. Or it could be somebody that you've been talking to for a while. So maybe you'll feel bad if you go with this other person because they have a stronger connection with this person. But you've been talking to this person. It's a lot. <laughs> like, I already feel it. It's a lot. Okay. Your wrist clarify the Ten of Cups. Why the Ten of Cups here? Yeah, somebody does make you very happy. It could be this Leo. I'm just noticing the sun in the back of this card. That's him. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Okay, yeah, you have Karma and the Knight of Wands. So you've been defensive. Um, again, I really do feel like this is the past energy here because you have karma. So somebody was karmic for you. They're coming back around for you to make a decision about this. They make you happy. Maybe you let them go in the past due to like, maybe you guys were both too guarded or something was happening here with the Nine of Wands. I'll clarify the Nine of Wands, but yeah, I mean, you got temperance again. You could have been dealing with Sagittarius, but yeah, I feel like the universe is giving you guys another try. But there are burdens in between the, yeah, Ten of Swords. So you've stopped thinking about this situation. You've wisened up. And then you got the Ten of Cups, again, with the full card in reverse. So maybe you guys didn't take this chance the first time. Yeah. Okay. What about the Six of Cups? Why is the Six of Cups here for Pisces? Why is the Six of Cups here for Pisces? Why is the six of cups here? Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, you could have tried to work something out with your ex before, but I feel like you did let the situation go with the um, four of Pentacles in reverse. Could have been dealing with a Capricorn. That's in. Yeah, maybe this was moving too fast to the past and it didn't work out. But I think you've let this go and now they're coming back around since you've let it go. That's fine. Clarify the page of cups. Why is the page of cups here? Why is the page of cups here? Five of cups, yeah. Somebody definitely felt regret. I feel like this is this person, this ex. They felt regret about letting you go. And they could be coming forward now. Clarify the page of cups. I think they made a bad decision because I don't know why. It could be a fire sign. Yeah. They could have, or they could be earth with fire in their chart. But, um, yeah, this person just looks really stupid to me. So maybe they're coming back like, I made a bad decision, da, 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 and you're like, yeah, you're stupid. Okay. They've had a page of cups. Why is the page of cups here? Nine of cups in reverse. Yeah, maybe they weren't. I think they're realizing that you were who made them happy, and they had to go, like, do something else to realize that yeah somebody I do feel like is coming back to you this all could go vice versa but I do feel like someone's coming back to you they about the four pentacles they've been holding on to this you let go but I feel like they've been holding on to this and they haven't been voicing that to you here with the moon card that they want a beginning with you they haven't told you and then like tower all of a sudden yeah so I feel like walking away eight of cups with the Seven of Swords and the Five of Swords at the bottom of the deck, all of this, you did not plan for them to come back to you. You planned to let this go like death card energy, like let it go and that's that. It didn't quite work out like that. And now I do feel like they want to they want to come back. They're sitting here. I feel like they're looking at the moon and you guys in the moon. They're thinking about approaching you and I think they do. They're with the Page of Cups, they definitely do. Yeah, Six of Cups here. This dude is, like, offering her flowers. 
and the Ace of Pentacles. So yeah, but you have to make a decision because I do feel like you have a connection with two people. So you have to make this judgment. So let's get some advice for you. Universe, what's your oh, hello. Shit. Okay, well, patience and the sun just showed itself to me. So if you're dealing with the Leo, be patient with the situation. Universe, what's the advice for Pisces? Page of air. So I'm getting with this card, speak your truth. And the love card showed itself to me. So like, definitely tell them how you really feel. Okay, these want to come out again. So eight of earth. I'm getting like work on building. So maybe this is for you guys to like, definitely speak your truth. You got the page of air and the messenger of air. Yeah, for sure speak your truth. If somebody's coming to speak their truth for you. But I'm getting work something out because the eight of pentacles keeps showing itself to me and that's like a work card for me. So work, work something out. Could be dealing with a Virgo, but yeah. Hmm. Temptation with the fool. Okay. <laughs> so normally this is like, this is Capricorn energy here. Can we deal with Capricorn? But maybe be the fool in the situation. I'm getting stay open-minded about the situation. Like nobody wants to go back to their ex, but there is a strong connection here. And nothing was planned here. And this is karmic. So whatever that means, there's a lesson to be learned in this whole situation. So be open-minded is what I'm getting with that. So... Hope this helped you out, Pisces. If you would like a personal reading, there are um, details down in the description box of how you can get one. And yeah, enjoy the rest of your month.